What is up? I haven't done one of these videos in a long time. But I want to get you guys caught up on what I've been buying from the retro shop. And I got a couple nice piles here of stuff I want to show off. Uh, let's start with the PSP games. Uh, I got this one today. This is the third birthday. This is the uh, the third game in the pers uh, not uh, uh, Parasite Eve series. I've never played that one. Uh, I have played this one on PS3, but I got the original version of Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker for PSP. Pretty excited about that. I found a Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops Plus. I have Portable Ops, but I don't have the Plus version. And now I do. Oh, I got Crisis Core! I've been looking for this one for ages, and... This camera does not like focusing. It's on autofocus, but... Just kind of does it whenever it feels like doing it. There we go. I've been looking for this one for a while. And finally found it. Finally found it. I'm happy about it. Uh, I got one DS game to show off. It's the last remaining physical copy of the entire um, Tales of series, except for Bursaria. I have Bursaria digital, but I don't have a physical copy of Bursaria yet. But I found Tales of Hearts for DS today. I've been looking for this and I couldn't find it until now. Very cool. I know this is on Vita as well, but this is the original release. Got some PS2 games. This is Minna no Golfu 4. Everybody's Golf 4, otherwise known as Hot Shots Golf 4. Actually, really, this might be questionable. Like, what? 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 I like these games. I don't know why, but there's something about these games that's just really fun for me. I've played since uh, I had a demo for Minna no Golf two on PS1 and I don't know I really liked it and yeah I've just always liked these games since then I want to get the new one I haven't played the new one yet uh, this is Shin Sangoku Muso 3 uh, this is Dynasty Warriors 4 in English uh, I haven't played any of the Dynasty Warriors games but I want to go back to the old ones so this is three two and one wait 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 three two and one that's how it goes uh, for PS2, I think. And then there was a, a previous one, which is Dynasty Warriors 1 original on PS1, I think. That was a fighting game. Uh, but af after the second one came out, which is Shin San Goku Muso 1, um, it was the uh, traditional, like, what do you call it? Like, killing massive armies with super ease <laughs> kinds of games that we know now uh, this is one of the early ones this is Shin San Goku Muso 3 the third one of those games uh, I also found Shin San Goku Muso 4 these were a dollar each at the shop uh, this is Dynasty Warriors 5 in English so excited to play these games I found a game that my friend Bunbarian has been telling me to look for, and I found it! It's Ateria Iris Eternal Mana. And there's two more games in the Iris series, the Iris trilogy, I should say. Um, look how cute, if it zooms, if it focuses. Oh, oh, come on. I hate autofocus cameras, they never work. Hello? There it goes, there it goes. Look how cute. Oh, it, it auto unfocused. Why? Oh, this camera sucks. I hate it. There it goes. Yay! Look at how cute these graphics look. I why does it do that? I hate this camera. I'm gonna throw it in the garbage. Stupid camera. I got uh, zero. Akaicho. This is this is Fatal Frame. Uh, red red butterfly. I I don't know what the title is in English, but it's a Fatal Frame game. Uh, I think it's the second one. Um, I like horror, and I've never played this. I want to get scared. I want to get scared. I can play it this October, next month. <gasps> That's soon. Ooh. I'm excited. I'm going to play this. I have never heard of this game. This is Code Age Commanders for PlayStation 2. It's Square Enix. 
This is what the back looks like. I thought, wow, that looks pretty interesting. It won't focus. It's stupid. It's not gonna focus. But they're very anime looking characters. Never heard of this. I don't even know if it's an RPG or not, but it is a Square Enix game. It looks like an RPG. So I'm gonna check this out sometime. Ah, Full Metal Alchemist 2 for PS2. Also by Square Enix. I've never played these, but it says it's an RPG. Probably like an action RPG or something. I'm gonna check that out. Cannot wait. Cannot wait. I got Wild Arms Advanced 3rd. I've never played a Wild Arms game, but I have 2 and 5, and now I have 3, and I'm trying to get the first one. They have the first one, but it's not as cheap as I want it to be. It, it's cheap, but I've seen cheaper, so I'm waiting on it. But I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna play them in order once I get a hold of all of them. Uh, these two are games I already had, but, you know, they had other releases, and I kind of wanted them, so, uh, this is Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. Now, I have way over here Kingdom Hearts, the original. This is Final Mix, same game, uh, whoops, sorry about that, I think that hit the mic. Same game, um... I think it's got more content. I've never played, well, I played it on PS4. That's the Final Mix version, I guess. But I don't know what content is new. I played this on PS2, and on the PS4 version I played, I guess it was Final Mix. Um, this has Japanese voiceovers. Despite being a Japanese release, this has no Japanese voices. This has only English with Japanese subtitles. So it's kind of interesting. And it even says on the back, it's like, warning, uh, this does not, Oh, it wasn't on this one. This one doesn't warn. Okay, so I got one more game on that topic. I got a game I'm gonna show you. Yeah, this one has the warning. Okay, I got Final Fantasy X International. And this is only in English with Japanese subtitles. Interesting. And it might have uh, extra content. I think, I think it has extra content. I, I think that's what we got in the HD remaster, but... Uh, there is actually a warning on the back saying, Caution, this version only has English voices. And it has Japanese and English subtitles, I think it says. Yeah. So it actually, like, they had to put a warning label on that. Uh, they didn't... I don't see a... No. It doesn't say that on the Kingdom Hearts one. But uh, it's interesting that they put that label on... Uh... Final Fantasy X. Yeah, this one doesn't have Japanese voices either. So, I don't know how fans received that in Japan, but uh, they're probably fine with it. I don't know. Personally, for Final Fantasy X, I would want that in Japanese if I was growing up with the Japanese version. Uh, Kingdom Hearts, I guess it would be like, give or take, whichever one. Yeah, that's all the new games I got. So, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the streams. Take it easy. Bye-bye!